and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit different and it's going to be still a small business Saturday but with kind of a new company. <laughs> so yeah, do subscribe if you like small business videos or hauls or anything spooky related and I will get straight into the video now. So this is the third video I am recording today which is why you've probably seen this outfit quite a lot but I did go for a Tudor vibe with this tudor sleeve which... I'm loving. <laughs> so you've probably seen me do some Rogue Moon videos on my channel. I did a main one. I included them in a giveaway. I probably did a collective haul with them somewhere. And they recently started doing crystals. So I got kind of really into the whole witchy side of like crystals using like sage and subscribing to witch casket. And I did all of that for a period of time and then I kind of went off of it a little bit I don't know I've always kind of gone through phases of things I guess I still like it but I'm just not as obsessed with it as I was I still like witchy fashion and all of that so I do have a small collection of crystals I usually wear crystal bracelets actually just because I really like the way they look um, and I do have a small collection but I kind of lost my love for crystals I guess um and I kind of thought they were a little bit boring so they sit in a box and I haven't really looked at them since I went through my whole witchy phase. When Rogue Moon said they were starting to do crystals I was like yeah okay all right <laughs> and they started doing crystal lives so you might be aware you might not but on their Instagram they do live streams every few weeks of like crystal sales so you can join on Instagram and it's basically like a live sale I guess and she will show the crystal and it will have like a number and a letter and you type that number and then you've like claimed that crystal and then she'll send you an invoice later so it's kind of like a buying event but it's also very in my opinion relaxing unless you like desperately want something that like loads of people are after <laughs> then it's not so much but overall I think it's relaxing it's got like really nice music and just it's a very calming video unless as I said you're desperately after a crystal so you don't have to buy anything you can just like sit there for the experience of it there's always like Tim Burton music um so I've literally been to every single one of hers and I just think they're so nice in my opinion and I did buy from her twice out of those crystal lives and that's what I've got to show you today she does have her normal Instagram which is Rogue Moon Shop but then she's created a new one for the crystals which is Rogue Moon Crystals so if you're looking for her live definitely follow her Rogue Moon Crystals Instagram so you don't get lost with all of that but these are what I've kind of got from her from the crystal lives and my whole point of that intro that I never really finished off was that I got bored of crystals I sat down and watched all her lives and I was just inspired again. I thought they're really, really pretty. And what I like about her specific crystals is they're very unique. You'll see what I mean when I finally get into it after this very long intro. But she's just kind of made me love crystals again, basically, which I really, really like. So the first one that I picked up from her second live stream, I believe, is this raven. Raven or crow whichever one and this is an obsidian crystal and it's got all these really nice carvings in and it is like quite a big piece and as you can see it's got all these really pretty carvings in it and it's just so pretty it is on a base and it does also have his feet kind of engraved in there and it does sit flat and it's just so so cute this would look so nice on like a crystal shelf i don't actually have one but this would look very nice on one of them um so yeah as i said this is an obsidian one she does sometimes have more of these in her lives but all her pieces are very limited as they are crystals they're not something you can just kind of keep getting the same one of unless they're kind of carved but i did pick up this one this one was i think around 25 pounds probably the most amount of money i've ever spent on a crystal um but for the size of it considering it's carved it's unique i just really liked it and it will look really cool with my kind of edgar Allan poe kind of display thing with all the skulls the ink pots the books that i have on my mini table i will just show you what i mean because you probably got no idea like over here i've kind of got this like snow globe this sign 
the raven and the skull which is very Edgar Allan Poe themed so yeah I figured that would look really cool on there so I did get this one as I said most I've ever spent but I'd say it's worth it for the detail the size the fact that it is a crystal so really really pretty and really, really pleased with this one all of the others I got on her most recent live the first piece that I kind of claimed on there was this piece of tourmaline now I'm not the best with the names but I literally <laughs> I wrote down what they were so I could tell you and this one says it's tour tourmaline or tourmaline I think it's tourmaline in quartz so the tourmaline is kind of the black kind of shiny part of this crystal and then it is kind of layered in this clear quartz piece and this one is a raw crystal as you can see it doesn't have like a gloss over it it is just a raw crystal and i thought this one was so so pretty so i did pick up this one i think it was around six ish pounds i don't have the exact pricing because it is like on an invoice that's like somewhere in my emails <laughs> but i did pick up that one i also picked up one of these tumble stones which looks like this and this is an amethyst I think it's got like a special name it like begins with a c yeah so this is this piece so i really liked all the layers in this one this one was one pound fifty so again really good price the next one has got to be one of my favorites and you probably saw this one on my instagram if you're following me on there if not i will leave it here so you can go and follow me on there and it's a little clear quartz ghost <laughs> So this is what he looks like and he's so cute. This is him. So as you can see he's got these tiny little pointy arms and then his kind of eyes and mouth have been engraved into it. And then the rest of him is this like clear smooth quartz. The base is completely flat so he does kind of stand up like that and he's just so cute. And you can also see all the kind of different layers within the quartz. I'm not sure if you'll be able to kind of see. Hopefully you can kind of see. He does look a little bit better when you hold him up to the light. You can really see it. But yeah, this is definitely one of my favourite crystals I own by far. He was a little bit more expensive. He was, I think, 25 as well. So same price as the Raven. And he is kind of a little bit smaller. But I just, when I saw him on the live, I fell in love with him. <laughs> but yeah, so, so cute. And you saw me take a photo with this and my ghost jumper, my ghost pin and ghost everything. So this is definitely so so cute um i was a bit concerned i was like oh should i have paid that much for a little ghost and then he arrived and i was like no regrets <laughs> at all so this is my little ghost guy he's so cute and i had to get the ghost because ghosts are like my thing so yeah i did pick up this clear quartz ghost and the last one in this haul this will be a shorter video which i guess is kind of nice for once and this is called i'm not sure if i'm butchering this or not blue aragonite this is something that is probably not interesting to some people i don't know why but i really really liked this piece in the live like i'm not even like a that into blue really but when i saw this piece i think it's the way it just like glittered in the light i was like oh my gosh <laughs> it's so pretty so i did pick up one of these this one was three pounds 50 i believe and she does different sizes so if you want like a smaller piece you could get them for like two pounds she does tumble stones as well so definitely caters to a lot of people's price ranges but this is this one and hopefully you can see what i mean by the way it catches the light it's just so pretty i just really really like it I will probably be on the lookout for more of this because I really, really like it. So yeah, those are all the pieces that I got from Rogue Moon. So I got the Raven the first time and then I got the Ghost, the Blue Aragonite, which I'm hopefully saying right, um, the Amethyst and then the Tourmaline. So those are all the ones that I got so far in the live. As I said, she's doing one this Friday when I'm filming. So I might get some more hopefully <laughs> they're quite addictive but also i don't know 
if you don't want to spend money maybe you shouldn't join them but they are as i said relaxing really nice experience also because there's not really i find there's not too much to do nowadays <laughs> to have something that's like a little event and you can be in your pajamas and relax and have like a hot drink it just sounds very cozy definitely what i'm into so definitely go and check out the next rogue moon crystals live i think she's going to start doing lives with her jewelry as well so that's really cool you can kind of see her pieces before you buy them so really really enjoying this i thought i'd just do a short video just on this just to kind of let you know about it and it'll be nice not to edit for like two hours <laughs> but yeah so let me know if you've gone to the rogue moon crystal live if you've heard of it if you have and you bought anything what did you get i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a like if you did Remember to press the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload. And as I said at the beginning, please do subscribe if you like small business videos. <laughs> Don't know why that took me forever to think of the word. So yeah, I do have a playlist of small businesses which I will link in the i. And yeah, you can go and watch a few more of those if you want to. And I will hopefully see you in my next video. Bye!